The views and opinions expressed by the hosts, guests or callers of this show do not necessarily reflect those of the staff or management of Radio Dihoris. The content broadcast on this show is meant for informational and entertainment purposes only. Radio Dihoris, the best and hottest Indian radio network in the entire world. Mahima Creations proudly presents Premier Evening Drive Time Show. Bam Bam! Yes, you heard it right. Bam Bam! Every Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Let's beat the traffic. Bam Bam! Bam Bam! Bam Bam! Namaskar! Namaskar! जय स्वामी नारायण जय श्री कृष्ण जय जरिंद्रा हमारे स्वामी भाई बंधु को बोल दे मोरारी मतलब बोलते हुए सारे फीजे बोले जन हम आ गए हैं आपके प्यारे महिमा के द्वारे मैं फालतू बाबा and of course myself falto rani lekar aapke liye go drive time that's going to make it totally exciting and totally totally mastani bada jani yes i bada of course abhi ke liye aapko bolta hai ki aaj wednesday hai and of course this actually is uh, again uh, we got a very sad news on uh, sunday um, exactly when the time of the basant panchmi is going on mar jan jab saraswati puja ka time pe we actually got a news that you know uh, lata ji actually has moved on from this realm Mm. and um, we actually yes it's a sad news but nevertheless we she's left us with good memories and 75 years of experience seven, seven decades of uh, you know presence in the industry right, right? so we decided you know sat din hum log ye sat din bas hum lata ji ko yaad karenge ha and uh, all, all the wonderful songs she has sung and everything so aaj wednesday being one of the things and one of those one of the uh, i think um she uh, her voice was so symbolic to many people right i know i know one of my friends whose dad was such a big ardent fan of uh, lata ji huh. he actually had uh, all the song collections on lp hmm. so some people are that way and and actually even that that transferred on to him as well so the impact of his dad lucky music or uh, one of my good friends uh, be uh, if you watching me of course uh, toshi this is something i'm telling you because i remember you actually used to you you drilled those lataji songs in all the tra- long dress we have got <laughs> with the we played them on your uh, car and all everything so i remember those days uh, but yes uh, today of course is uh, wo be gone wednesday with what was the songs so if you have any songs which actually uh, this is, is the way you uh, drive away the wolves mm-hmm. uh, give us a call here 4089122479 and we always have told you sad songs जो होते हैं दर्द भरे नगमे जो होते हैं जनरली आर कथार्टिक इन 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 नेचर सो दे एक्चुअली मेक यू फील गुड व्हेन यू एक्चुअली लिसन टू देम एंड टुडे प्रोबब्ली विल हियर सम ऑफ दोस सॉन्ग्स फॉर श्योर एंड अगर आप कोई ऐसा कोई यू नो सॉन्ग हो जो व्हेन यू आर सैड व्हेन यू आर डाउन योर ब्लूज यू एक्चुअली सिंग शेयर विद अस एंड होपफुली इट विल बी द सॉन्ग व्हिच एक्चुअली वाज सॉन्ग बाय लता जी एंड दैट वी कैन प्रेजेंट इन टुडे शो एज़ वेल सो अगेन नंबर टू कॉल हियर 4089122470 आई डोंट नो व्हाई आई सेड दिस अगेन एंड अगेन एंड अगेन बट अगेन नंबर टू कॉल 4089122470 लेकिन किस चीज के बारे में कॉल करेंगे वो लोग आई जस्ट नाउ शेयर द फॉर दनी दैट दे कैन कॉल बिकॉज़ इफ दे हैव अ सॉन्ग व्हिच दे यूज एज़ समथिंग व्हिच दे ड्राइव अवे द वोस ओह माय गॉडनेस ड्राइव अवे I know. I don't know how many people actually do that when they're sad. Do they actually listen to music? Or? Well, uh, I think uh, many will do it. We even talked about that part of it, mm-hmm. and uh, we have uh, talked on many shows. Will be gone Wednesdays to be one of those shows. Like in arts, will be gone Wednesdays specifically with Lata Ji's shows. That's right. But the channel Lata Ji's songs. And if you want to call here, studio number is eight nine eight nine one two two four seven nine. Again. तो आलतू बाबा आज चालू करते हैं बहुत सारी ऐसे वैसे लता जी की जिंदगी में ही काफी सारे यू नो पीपल इफ यू थिंक अबाउट इट राइट मेनी पीपल से दैट कि उनकी जिंदगी में यू नो शी वॉज वेरी सक्सेसफुल she came from a very musical family she did what she wanted to do um she even uh, you know lived a life on her own terms all that stuff right were there moments of vulnerability were there moments of tragedy in her life mm-hmm. uh uske bare mein thoda um we'll take the we'll try to see if we can wade through her life a little bit to oh, see oh wow interesting yeah and what was it that she had to deal with as well mm-hmm. as she was out there singing 
um, and as she was out there um, making a life for herself and her whole family. So, for that, today you have to call us. The studio number is 408-912-2479. And first of all, let's go to our Bindu. No, actually, let's go to Bindu. Which song will we start with? Your choice is, what do you think? Uh, is there something? Because that's something which you love. <laughs> right, I know that for sure. You actually love all these beautiful songs. But if you still want to choose to go to a bandhu, I don't mind. Ha. Let's go. Namaskar, aapka hadik swagat hai. Pam Pam mein kon hai ji? Pam 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 Oh my God, kaise hai aap, Deepa ji? Ha. कैसे हैं आप मैं ऐसे हाँ कहा बदलेंगे आप राइट क्या हम उन लोगों में से तो बदल जाए ऋतु बदल जाए सब बदल जाए लेकिन हम हम कभी नहीं बदलेंगे और यहाँ सुधरेंगे राइट एग्जैक्टली तो वेलकम वेलकम कैसे हैं आप यू नो तो टुडे ऑफ कोर्स वो भी कॉल वेंसडे एंड इट्स दैट पर्टिकुलर टाइम दॉन्ग विच एक्चुअली यू सिंग वेन यूर सैड सुदीपा जी आप तो गाते हो मुझे बारे में लेकिन क्या आपके लिए कोई ऐसा गाना है जो आप गाते हो जो न्यू फील कैन फील में लो समटाइम्स यू नो एंड आर हैव दे आर दे आर दे एनी ऑफ एनी ऑफ देम लता जी रेंडिशन हाँ वैसे बहुत सारे उन उनके साइड सॉंग्स बहुत सुंदर सुंदर हैं लाइक जब भी मैं मतलब मुझे ये कि ये गाना गाना है अमर प्रेम का मूवी इट्सेल्फ इज सैड एंड द होल फील ऑफ दैट सॉन्ग इज वेरी लाइक वेरी नाइस रहना बीती जाए मैं मुर्किया वगैरह थोड़ा ये हो गए होगा इधर उधर गड़बड़ होगा साइड प्राइस शाम रहना बीती तो आप ये गाना गाते हो कि आपके ज़हन में आता है विन्यू फीलिंग्स आए? हाँ हाँ मैं गाती हूँ बजाती हूँ उसको बजाती हूँ तो ऐसे ही मतलब ये फालतू ना नहीं ये वो भी गॉन मतलब क्या है? वो वो बोलते हैं राइट वो भी गॉन कि दुख चला जा चला जा वो भी गॉन। When you want to drive away all your sadness no, no, no. Yeah, well, actually, wo as in not like uh, Hindi wo, wo as in uh, the hardships and tough times. Worries. Uh, worries. Worries uh, be gone. Okay. Worries, no, sadness be gone. Wo ka matlab hota sad. But anyway, thank you so much. In fact, um, see, the thing is when you're sad, right, sometimes what happens automatically, we some people tend to, you know, dwell on the sadness and it go on and on, goes deeper and deeper into a, into the into a trough, right? Uh, and then the, mm -hmm. the, the thing is, everybody goes through it. Uh, it's about how we can mm -hmm. pick ourselves up and come up, right? Uh, and these songs actually gives us the opportunity to suddenly change our concept. And you, you'll just suddenly relate to the song, you feel the sadness and you come out of it. That's the whole idea, right? Um, not just keep, keep on uh, dig, digging deeper into the sadness part of it. So these songs are actually a Vobicon song, which actually gets you to feel the sadness. Rona to rodo, ek do ti nasu bahado. And yeah. move on with life, right? That's yeah. what it is. Yeah. Correct. Yeah. Yeah. You have to, बोलते हैं ना आलतू बाबा लाइक यू हैव टू पास थ्रू द टनल मतलब वो उसको फेस करना अच्छा है लाइक इसके उसको हाइड करने से और एस्केपिंग इज़ नॉट अ सॉल्यूशन. Very good. Like you accept it and you dwell in it and drench in it and then come out of it. Yeah. Nice. Exactly. Like yeah. Exactly. So feel it. So actually आलतू लता जी ने जब मैंने वो एक फिलहाल मैंने जितने इंटरव्यू पालतरानी तुमने देखा है अभी मैं देखूंगी बाद में लेकिन ये जो मैंने इंटरव्यू देखा उसमें कोई तो आई मीन शी सेड लाइक यू नो आप जब क्वेश्चन पूछा गया कि कि आप कैसे मतलब गाने को ये करते हैं लाइक यू नो हाउ डू यू सिंग यू सो सिंग सो वेल विद द फील तो उन्होंने � आ गाने के फील को महसूस करना चाहिए अपने दिमाग में 
उसको बिठाना है यू गेट टू सेंस दैट उसके बाद एंड ऑल्सो उन्होंने कहा भी कि यू हैव टू टुक द सोल इन द सॉन्ग एनी सॉन्ग तभी वो उसका ये आएगा मजा आएगा टू सेंस उभर के आएगा मैं hmm. ऐसे ही लाइक बाय हार्ट करके कोई मतलब रैंडम नहीं मतलब पहले लैंग्वेज को समझो उसके बाद उसको फील द सोल ऑफ द सॉन्ग वेदर इज हैप्पी और सैड तो वो मैं पहले करती थी उसको पढ़ के दो तीन बार पढ़ के उसको दो तीन बार अपने आप गा के एंड ईच वर्ड मीनिंग सब सुन के देन आई यूज टू सिंग इट सो दैट इट गिट्स द ट्रू एसेंस हां बट यू यूज्ड टू राइट आजकल क्यों नहीं करते हो हां मजाक था मजाक था जोक जोक आजकल क्यों नहीं करते हो बोला मैंने क्योंकि सर आई यूज्ड टू डू द बोला आपने यू सेड यू सेड मैं करती हूं अरे यू सेड आई यूज्ड टू व्हाट You said I used to do that, बोला आपने तो मैं बोला why don't you do it still? नहीं 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 I used to नहीं नहीं उन्होंने ऐसा बोला अच्छा अच्छा she did she did how she her methodology of like any song like singing Very from good. the start to end वो बोल रही थी yes excellent wonderful thank you so much yeah. for chiming in today and आप हो सके तो गाना definitely लगाऊंगा ठीक है हाँ thank you Bye-bye. thank you so much for calling in and of course binajan um is uh, today we are celebrating again the life and the work and the love of lata mangeshkar ji and her beautiful songs um to uh, jab uh, <coughs> lekin humne shraddhanjali ke din mein humne saar saar nahi lagaye hum log saar saar baate generally um ek uh, शख्स की जो जिंदगी है उसको सेलिब्रेट करने के लिए वी डोंट ऑलवेज टॉक अबाउट द सैड थिंग्स इन देयर लाइफ वी एक्चुअली टॉक अबाउट व्हाट द हाईलाइट्स इन देयर लाइफ व्हाट ब्रॉट देम क्लोजर टू अस एज एज देयर एज लवर्स ऑफ देयर म्यूजिक और लवर्स ऑफ देयर आर्ट फॉर्म तो एंड uh, कल तो हमने बात किया टीम प्लेयर ट्यूसडे के बारे में जहाँ पे लता जी और उनके फीमेल को सिंगर्स के साथ उनका मतलब uh, उनके जो ब्यूटीफुल ब्यूटीफुल गाने थे एंड uh, कुछ किस्से थे वो आपके साथ शेयर किए तो आज कुछ ऐसे किस्से शेयर करेंगे जहाँ पे uh, शायद ही लोगों को मालूम होगा कि uh, लता जी की ज़िंदगी में Uh, क्या हुआ था mm-hmm. uh, या uh, उनकी जिंदगी में कुछ ऐसे घटनाएं जो घटी mm-hmm. जो उनको लगा उनको बहुत ही धक्का पहुंचा राइट सो यू नो अल्त बाबा एक uh, किस्सा याद आता है mm-hmm. जहां पे uh, ऐसे लगता है कि uh, लता मंगेशकर जी को uh, एक इंटरव्यू में uh, किसी ने पूछा था वेन शी वॉज आई थिंक शी वॉज अबाउट एटी टू ईयर्स ओल्ड आई थिंक राजीव मसन का इंटरव्यू था आई एम नॉट श्योर बट बट इट वॉज समी हु आस्ट कि यू नो हैव यू एवर फेल्ट लाइक यू नो आपने शादी नहीं की एंड हैव यू एवर फेल्ट लाइक देर इज यू नो अ सेंस ऑफ लोनलीनेस और वट एवर राइट In many interviews, she has been asked this, and she has dismissed it off, saying, "You know, um, no, it's all the will of God, and I had a lot of responsibility." But very few people know that actually, she shared a very close friendship with somebody called Raj Singh Dungarpur. Aha, Raj Singh ji, ha, very yeah. good. Yeah. So Raj Singh was um, um, actually uh, somebody who came from the royal family. and um uh, you know this person was uh, connected also uh, to lata mangeshkar ji as a very close friend mm-hmm. and incidentally uh, ye dekhiye lata ji ko uh, cricket mein uh, jo fascination tha ye bcci that is the board control for cricket in india ke president the raj singh dungarpur sir mm-hmm. theek hai और इंटरनेशनल बिजनेस टाइम्स के हिसाब से बोथ ऑफ देम वर एक्चुअली लुकिंग टू गेट मैरिड उन दोनों की शादी होने की बात हो रही थी बट व्हेन ही इन्फॉर्म हिज पेरेंट्स दे वर डेड अगेंस्ट इट बिकॉज हिज फादर हु वाज महारावल लक्ष्मण सिंह जी सेड दैट नो गाने वाली है वी आर नॉट गोइंग टू एक्सेप्ट दिस प्रपोजल so although lata ji never confirmed this affair she didn't deny it either okay mm-hmm. but she only attributed that she's not getting married because she's got responsibilities of her house kind of relates and uh, it if you look at her song na altu mm-hmm. baba mm-hmm. kind of 
brings you to Mughal e Azam, right? Oh my God, Falzani, what a great uh, lead no, in ka. Kya deduction tha tera? Ha. I agree with you. Yes, yes. So in Mughal e Azam, bahut sare gaane hain. Salim. <laughs> God. Aldo. Yeah, Aldo. Yeah, itna cheez aur naachne wali gaane wali, right? That's yeah, what she is. Yeah, she is. Yeah, correct. And um, you know, there are beautiful songs in the movie, and uh, I think most of the songs are sad songs, but there is. One particular song which is rarely aired, Altu Baba. Yeah, yeah, that's one which is the one where she's getting the the punishment is being given to her, right? Yeah, where she's going to be killed, right? Mm-hmm. She was sentenced to death. Ah, वो एक गाना है बंजर उनके आवाज में जो बहुत ही heart tugging वाला गाना है तो वो सुने क्या Altu? fact uh, ye sad situation hai because this is when she actually has been taken out to be executed yeah but she not executed it was a very cruel treatment where she was supposed to be dafnafied in yeah the, she uh, was buried alive right sad that's a mm. every time i think mm. of the story i don't think of any of the positive in the story at all yeah. it's only the negative part of it how yeah. the whole world is you know how people will treat correct when somebody from different classes and structures right correct society because she's some different from a social the storyline is that she is from a different uh, s- a social strata as opposed to the the lover she had salim right and salim could not do anything also about it yeah. but we have a bandh waiting line so i can do one thing father and i can take the calls on air mm-hmm. hello hi who is this pam 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 bachan pam pam bachan aap kaise hain sir pam pam apna ka bada ehsaan malik ka karam aap logo ki duaein और मैंने बोला की आज हम लोग लता जी के गाने सुन रहे हैं लेकिन लता जी के गानों में वो गाने सुन रहे हैं जो एक्चुअली एकदम एक दर्द भरे नगबे होते हैं ना ऐसे वाले गाने सुन रहे हैं हम लोग सो आपके हिसाब से हाँ आप तो एक बात बताओ बताइए सर कि लता जी दुनिया से क्यों उग गई है ऐसा लगता है कि जैसे कोई बहुत बड़ी हस्ती निकल गई हो करेक्ट करेक्ट बहुत बड़ी हस्ती सही बात है सर सही बात है सर तो अल्लाह उनके रूह को जनरल फिर में जगह दे और शांति दे बड़ी प्यारी औरत थी बहुत जबरदस्त औरत थी हाँ जी सर हाँ जी सर थैंक यू बहुत प्यारी औरत वो फाइटर थी फाइटर सही है सर स्ट्रगलिंग स्ट्रगलिंग शुरू में बड़ा स्ट्रगल किया उसने हाँ जी सर उनके उनके जीना नाथ के निकलने के बाद बड़ा स्ट्रगल किया और फिर कहीं जाके वो स्टेबलिश हुई और ऐसी हुई की पिछहत्तर अस्सी साल तक वो अपनी पोजिशन पे रही बिल्कुल न किसी को आगे आने दिया न किसी को पीछे जाने दिया <laughs> एक दफा तो क्या हुआ कि अवार्ड डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन सेरेमनी में उसने ऐलान किया था कि आप लोग मुझे इतने अवार्ड न दें और भी बहुत से गाने वाली औरतें हैं उनको भी दिया करे करेक्ट और हम आज से अवार्ड नहीं लेंगे hmm. ये लता जी के अल्फाज थे करेक्ट सर करेक्ट बट सर ये देखो ना आज हम लोग क्या बात करें की उनके जो गाने हैं तो आप बताइए 
ये दर्द बर नगमे आपको अच्छा लगता है डू यू लाइक देम आप सुनते हो हाँ हम तो भाई बड़े सुनते हैं बराबर कोई याद है आपको जो लता जी का दर्द बर नगमा जो आपके दिल के बहुत करीब है मैं वो अभी मेरे जाहिर में आया था अभी एक सेकंड मेरे को दो हाँ हाँ एक तो वो आपने एक तो वो है ना आएगा आने वाला महल का गाना है करक वो करक हर दुख भरा तो नहीं है वो मगर वो भी सुनने के लायक है गाना सही बात है मानते हैं सर मानते हैं और कुछ एक गाना फिल्म फिल्म अंदाज का है फिल्म अंदाज का है राज कपूर नरगीश दिलीप कुमार और ये गाना नरगीश सर फिल्माया गया था मैं आपको गा के बताता हूँ उठाए जाऊ के सुतम और जिए जा मुस्कुराए जा पिए जा उठाए जाऊ के सुतम बहुत प्यारा गाना है हाँ सर ये गाना मैंने एक ही बार सुना जब हमने एक बार काफी साल पहले एक शो के तो जहाँ पे हम लोग बात ही करते थे हाँ, उस जमाने में कैसे हमारे हीरोज जो है ना म्यूजिशियंस के रोल प्ले करते थे एंड दिलीप कुमार का फेवरेट म्यूजिक म्यूजिक इंस्ट्रूमेंट क्या था मालूम है पियानो हर एक फिल्म में हाँ पियानो पकड़ के पियानो पियानो हर एक हीरो फीचर ऑन प्लेइंग बट थैंक यू सो मच सर हो सके तो वो गाना भी आपके लिए पेश करेंगे फॉर श्योर ठीक है सर जरूर जरूर बड़ी मेहरबानी थैंक यू सर सुनते रहेगा सर आपको अच्छा लगेगा आज का शो फॉर श्योर थैंक यू थैंक यू सो मच एंड नमस्कार आपका हार्दिक स्वागत है पाँ पाँ। पाँ कैसे हैं आप बिल्कुल बढ़िया है आपसे पहचाना नहीं है अरे मेघा जी हाउ के अभी ये ये आप हम पे ये ट्रिक ना खेलिएगा प्लीज <laughs> पहचान लिया हमने आपको हाँ <laughs> वैसे ही आप पैम पैम बोलते ना वो स्टाइल ही अलग है एकदम डिफरेंट पर अच्छा लगा आपको बहुत दिनों के बाद सुनते हो यहाँ पे हाँ बहुत दिनों के बाद सुन रही हो जनरली सुने आजकल आई एम गोइंग टू पिक फिर मेरा वो ध्यान भटक रहा था सो आई वॉज नॉट पुटिंग द रेडियो ऑन सो अभी आज घर पे हो तो ऐसे रोक लेट मी लिसन इन पैम पैम हाँ हमें हमें बहुत अच्छा लगा कि आपने आपका आवाज बहुत दिनों के बाद हम सुन रहे हैं ऑन ऑन द फोन ऑन द फोन एग्जैक्टली एग्जैक्टली एंड आप देख भी सकते हो मेघा जी आप अगर अभी से फोन करने के लिए फोन बंद किया वेरी गुड थैंक यू सो मच थैंक यू सो मच तो सेम आज वो भी कौन वेनजडे में आपके हिसाब से वो भी कौन गाने आप सुनते हैं डू यू लाइक दम डू यू एंजॉय कोई ऐसा गाना जो है जो लता जी का आपको याद आ रहा है जो विच यू जर्नी टेन टू हम एंड यू नो ट्राई टू अपने मन को बहलाना बोलते ना वेन यू एक्चुअली फीलिंग सैड ऐसा कुछ करते हो कुछ बहलाने वाला तो नहीं बट वो भी कौन सॉन्ग एक इनका बहुत मुझे बहुत पसंद है जाने किस ये गाना बहुत बहुत दर्द भरा गाना है उनके बहुत सैड सॉन्ग्स और भी हैं जो पसंद है मतलब जैसे मेरी मम्मी को वो बहुत पसंद था रुला के गया सपना मेरा और फिर वो लो एक और भी गाना है जो हमारी जो हमें बंदूक सुनेंगे थोड़े दिनों में रंगीला रे वो भी बहुत पसंद था सो उनके काफी गाने हैं जो सैड सॉन्ग पसंद है पर ये ये गाना ये इट्स इट हैज लाइक मेलिंकनी ऑफ दिस सॉन्ग इट्स टू मच तुम न जाने के जहां में खो गए म्यूजिक एंड एवरी थिंग आई थिंक आई वन ऑफ द Very nice song, song. Very true. In fact, that 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 actually has is on our featuring on our list today. Mm-hmm. So, hume problem ye kya tha na ki, as you know, I, I, okay by observation, Falto, anyway, mm-hmm. I think Mega, you also might second or might not, you might challenge it also. I think uh, Lata Ji somehow has got most of the pathos songs. Uh, most of pathos songs. Aasha ke gaane kam milte hain pathos. Correct. But Lata ke to bahut milte hain. Yes, because how I observed this was when I was when I was I I wasn't actually a big artist listener of Lata Ji songs. By the way, let me yeah. be honest about that. And also the fact that when when one of my friends used to actually we used to go for these long drives, used to go wadi bashing in, in the Middle East and everything. So, kareeb two hours, three hours, we used to be right, driving in the desert area kind of thing, right? So, us us time me he used to have songs on a CD. Oh wow! And, <clears throat> my goodness, all 
all the songs. There used to be like around 50 or 100 songs in the CD MP3 files, right? Huh. There used to be all sad songs. I was like, what are you doing, dude? You're supposed to go on a happy vacation time. Oh my God. But then that's the thing, you know, that, so that's my memory and that stuck on to me quite some time. So then I started realizing that, okay, she does have a lot of sad, sad songs which she has sung. Uh, fortunately, unfortunately, whatever. Or the fact that her voice is suited or yeah. rather she suddenly, uh, her pathos rendition was more believable for people, I suppose. Correct. <laughs> Hence, he got that project. I don't know. Could be either ways, right? Uh, whichever way it's happened. He got projects also, no? Uh, we uh, kind of box people also. Correct. So, just uh, say, I'll give you an example. Dete. So, heroine ke gaane inko diye jate the aur Asha ko bubbly gaane diye jate the. Just say, kuch dil ka ye gaana Lata ke paas hai. Ushi movie ka जो मस्ती वाला गाना है भीगी भीगी फजा छन छन कल के जिया वो आशा के पास है तो एक ही मूवी में यू कैन सी द डिफरेंस राइट जो पैथोस वाला गाना है वो लता को जाता था और जो ये शशमीला का गाना है और जो उसका गाना था वो शशिकला का दैट वेंट टू आशा तो इट हैपेन दैट they were kind of boxed also in that way. Hmm. Not that Asha could not sing Patho song or Lata could not sing Bubbly songs. No, I think it was um, uh, in in um, an interview with uh, NDTV several years ago. Mm -hmm. She was asked this particular question, mm -hmm. right? And she actually said, I think uh, Asha wanted to steer clear of my lane. Ah. So she chose uh, those, uh, I mean, you know, uh, she chose to brand herself as more of the, the bubbly, the sexy songs. But she said, but Asha is limiting herself. In that interview, she says that. Mm. Uh, she actually, uh, she, if you listen, she's got a whole bunch, and of course, it was in retrospect. Maybe she's right, right you know? she said she's she can sing everything beautifully. Yeah, correct. No, she's right. No, Limiting, uh, yeah. yeah, absolutely right. Asha's sad songs are also superb. Yeah. But since we're talking about Lata today, so we'll talk about Lata only. But Asha also has amazing. Right. Correct. Right. Absolutely. So, um, you know. Uh, but again, thank you so much, Venka Ji. You have called us today and our show is done. So, for you, we will definitely we'll try to see if we can land up. I think it's there on the list, right? You know, it's there on the list, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. So, we'll see if we can bump it up a little bit. But listen to it. We'll definitely play a song for you for sure. Okay? Thank you so much. Thank you so much for calling in. And of course, Manjan, you can call us here. Yes, Megha Ji, Merchant Sahib, Deepa Ji, everybody calling. And of course, if you want to call back again, if something else came up to mind and you want to talk about it, share with us for sure. And now, I just want to know, Fadani, why don't you just play a nice song, one of the songs with Mama Merchant Sahib asked about, right? The song for the movie Andaz. Thoda about Suning Yos Gane Ko. And we'll come back and we have a ton of other songs for you guys. ये आपकी फरमाइश टाइप का गाना शो नहीं है बदरजन। but the point is we definitely have a bunch of songs which we want to share with you guys। yeah and and little bit talk about लता जी अस्पताल and what a wonderful versatile singer she was। you have a surprise coming up। बेगाज़ जी ने बताया कि बदु जीवन जी ने probably she is at the post already। we have planned a very nice show for you guys on Friday। yeah so definitely make sure you tune in on Friday for sure on our show। okay absolutely but we have one more बंदूक वेटिंग के लिए गोड़ दें before the कॉल सॉन्ग। let's go bam bam namaskar कौन है जी Pam Pam. Hi, Vibhaji, how are you? Hi, Baba, Falsani. Hi, Pam Pam. Vibhaji, how are you? I'm fine. How are you doing? Wonderful. If we are on speaker, car phone, we want to say Pam Pam to Jaina. Hey, Jaina, Pam Pam. Thank you. So sweet. Love you. Love you. Oh, good God, sweetheart. Love you too. Don't worry. You relax. You relax. We're going to disturb your mom right now. So, Vibhaji, Vibhaji, today's show is where we're going. So, you... I think you called on one of our previous shows where we go and saying that you also think sad songs are cathartic some way or the other. Yeah. So let's see, aapke zahen mein koi aara hai Lata ji ka kwaana which actually is something with you hum along when you are in that particular mood, you know? Yeah, in ki kaafi achche achche sad songs bhi hai. I think one song that stands out and I don't know if it's going to really qualify for a sad song but uh... In my opinion, it it will, but some people may not agree with it. But I was thinking of um, the Lajja Gale song, Lajja Gale. Mm. Uh, huh. I think that's a sad song because uh, I don't remember if I watched this movie or not, but whenever I, I hear that song, you know, um, I know it's picturized on Sadna, and whenever I hear that song, I just feel like, you know, something is going on in the song where... Uh, you know, while she's singing for, you know, whoever her lover or her love is, um, you know, I think it's almost like she's thinking of next lives and 
you know, we're not going to be together in this life, so, you know, let's embrace now because I don't know if I'm ever going to see you again in this life. So to me, that's a really, uh, it's a very touching song. It's a very sad song huh. for me. Okay, but the, I think uh, the, yeah, yeah, again, um, I always have said this, right? Mm. Songs, poetry is, uh, makes sense in the mind of the reader or the the Listener. audience, the audience. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. So correct, probably, correct, probably you correct, see, correct. you you see that uh, that particular song as a sad song, but actually that song is more of a, a call of call of a lover to another person, right? Isn't it? Or is it a okay. is it like saying that okay, this is like end of days. <laughs> let's uh, let's be that. What well, do you I, I, I haven't I seen. Know, the movie. I haven't seen the movie, but uh, some people say that it could be like a sad song because like ja gale say, mm. but um, you know it does. For me, I don't feel that it's a sad song only because I feel it's more of a philosophical song. Yeah, because in Ki, this... Like, let's ha, not ha. lose this moment. I, I've, I've seen the video of the song. In this video ah. of the song, I think she's trying to appeal to the guy and mm. she gets emotional. Basically, she's like, oh, I need your you know, attention, I need your stuff. Yeah, yeah. So probably that could be a sad song also, Fatan, it's all you know, right? Yeah, Very you good. never know. Yeah. But thank yeah. you so it's subjective and I think it also depends on the mood of the listener. Mm -hmm. So, if okay. let's say you uh, have gone on a date with somebody you like, right? Mm -hmm. And then then it's like, oh, you know, it was such a nice date. We hugged and then the date uh, ended. Uh, and then she she's looking forward to the next time probably mm -hmm. that, you know, they meet up. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, but now, if it's, if it's somebody like, let's suppose, uh, you know, sadly, let's suppose somebody's uh, lover has has just passed away. Okay, yeah. it's a very negative scenario. But let's pretend, uh, suppose that that has happened. Yeah. Then you know your hope is or your 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 aspiration is that. Okay, let's pretend that that has happened. Then you know your hope is or your 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 aspiration is that. Okay, let's pretend that that has happened. Then you it's over for now and I'm hoping that, you know, in our next life we get to reunite again. Now, this is for the people who believe in uh, reincarnation and stuff mm. like that. So, just you poll you, it all depends upon the mood and the situation of the person um, listening. Yeah. Wonderful. Thank you yeah. so much. And that actually does uh, come on our, on our uh, list. But actually, since it's been played quite a lot of time, we have not actually moved it up. We'll yeah. see if we can line it up for sure. Vivari uh, Sundari, okay? Sounds good. Thanks, guys. Thank, Thank you, you so much Thanks. for calling in. And of course, Banjan, again, yeah, yeah, this is a show which we are dedicating to Lataji. We are in her memory. Um, and of course, why seven? Because <laughs> of the fact that we think seven decades of presence in the industry yeah. wants us to actually talk about her. And of course, yeah, jitna bhi aap unke gaane sunoge na, you actually will come back to it again and again and again, which many of us have done it, right? Right. Uh, kitne saal radio stations apne nikal rahe unke gaane pe, right? Huh. Hum log bhi, we are so dependent on the content created by Bollywood. So I want to thank all the Indian film industry to actually, uh, you know, make such wonderful content. So, so shows like ours can be there. We can actually interact, right? It becomes part of our culture. Yeah. So I think she's going to be there forever and ever in our hearts. Like how we have the great Zafi Saab, Kishore Saab, everybody, even Lataji is one of those people who are going to be live with us forever and ever. Mm -hmm. At least our generation, the next generation also for the matter, because we are listening to our next generation, because we are listening to our next generation, but at least as long as Media Mahima is here, we definitely make sure that we actually, uh, you know, uh, recount every aspect of our Indian uh, history, that is our uh, uh, film industry for the past 113 years. Take pride in the Baranjan, it's a 113 year old uh, industry. Um, and uh, prolific industry for sure. And the uh, world record unko mila tha. But I see mila tha, it actually can be world record for the industry because in 2009, 2010, they actually hit around 1,200 movies released in a year. Wow. That particular industry. Wow. Now, is it a world record? Did they get a plaque for it? I don't think so. But definitely, it's a record which people have been maintaining somewhere around the world, right? Even Hollywood doesn't do the kind of movies. Correct. So content-wise, chal raha hai. And when we had wonderful people like Dadaji and everybody else giving us wonderful kind of in the times, right? Abhi toh different ho raha hai, lekin fir bhi, right? Even the sad songs now don't connect with me somehow because I think uh, point to what uh, Deepa ji talked about, right? Mm -hmm. uh, Deepa ji said it. Lata ji said in her uh, uh, interview, uh, it seems like she was a method singer. <laughs> Huh. Because she used to actually feel the meaning of the song and then sing it, right? <coughs> because generally, you know, Falthani, I was just thinking about this. Uh, ye, mein bhi hai because what you see on screen is 
द सेकेंड हाफ ऑफ द जेनेसिस ऑफ अ पर्टिकुलर सॉन्ग लाइफ ऑफ अ सॉन्ग एक्चुअली स्टार्ट ऑफ इन दिन ऑफ दिस्ट फर्स्ट ही हैज अ आइडिया ऑफ इट ही ब्रिंग्स अपट विजुअलाइज द सॉन्ग वो विजुअलाइज करके जो जो पेपर पे है या डिजिटल पे जो भी है ना जो सुर लगाता है म्यूजिक डायरेक्टर ही एज अ डिफरेंट लाइफ टू डिगेन राइट ओके द वे आई सी इट इज डिफरेंट फेज ऑफ सॉन्ग मेकिंग कमिंग इनटू एग्जिस्टेंस राइट एंड मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंटली आफ्टर द म्यूजिक डायरेक्टर क्रिएट्स दैट पर्टिकुलर विजन एंड क्रिएट्स अ पर्टिकुलर थिंग टू इट द सिंगर Hmm. takes it and creates their own vision because abhi tak dekho they have not seen the pictureization of the song hmm. with that they the emotion they brought out in the song just by understanding what the poet wanted what the music director wanted then it translates to the artist to emote based on what the song is feeling right exactly so uh, let's give that chronology to bandhus right mm-hmm. तो जनरली जब मूवी शूटिंग्स होती है बंदुजन गाने साउंड ट्रैक का रिकॉर्डिंग पहले ही हो जाता है करेक्ट बिफोर द मूवी एक्चुअली गोज इनटू फिल्मिंग यस द साउंड ट्रैक इज इनफैक्ट उस जमाने में तो गाना पहले से ही रिकॉर्ड हो जाता था क्योंकि उनको लिपसिंग करना पड़ता है राइट टू द फॉर द आर्टिस्ट जो uh, आजकल तो फिर भी यू नो मॉन्टा शॉर्ट्स लेके फिर लॉन्ग uh, शॉर्ट्स लेते हैं देव दीज क्रेन शॉर्ट्स एंड थिंग्स लाइक दैट वेर रियली द आर्टिस्ट डेव टू गिव लिप टू दैट पर्टिकुलर सॉन्ग लेकिन उस जमाने में ऐसे होता था जहाँ पे यू नो यू एक्चुअली बिलीव दैट दे आर सिंगिंग दैट लाइक यू नो जैसे इन्होंने कहा कि साधना गा रही है लगजा गले से यू बिलीव दैट you know to be able to make it believable both of them have to work in sync the singer mm-hmm. as well as the artist to um wo uh, uske bare mein altu baba keh rahe the to i think uh, the a lot of the onus lies on the person who sang the song that depth on subst- uh, substance jo hai isiliye hame lagta hai i think it deteriorated in the 80s and 90s very true because very true. um people were looking at just quantity like you know i'm sorry but there are some singers where you don't feel anything mm-hmm. when you hear the song um it, they sing in artificial voices they sing with artificial vibratos in the voice mm. you don't feel anything the composition may be good they were lucky that they got those compositions but really you don't feel like andar se wo kuch nahi hota hai you don't feel the द सोल स्टरिंग द हार्ट टगिंग काइंड ऑफ फीलिंग जो उस जमाने के गानों में होता था वही ट्रफाथी एंड ये इमेजिन फॉर अ सिंगर लाइक लाइक्स ऑफ आर ग्रेट्स रशफी साहब वाई वी थिंक दसम इज वो जो इमोशन लाते थे उसी को लिप दे देते या विजुअल दे देते आर्टिस्ट लोग बट आर्टिस्ट लोगों को इमोशन टच करने के लिए दैट सॉन्ग हैव पावरफुल आल्सो एनीवे वी गॉट अ बंदू वेटिंग लेट्स गो टू देम प्लीज एंड नमस्कार आपका हर स्वागत है पैम पैम की वो भी गॉन वेंसडे में हो दिस हेलो पैम पैम यू ऑन एयर आप ऑन एयर है जी कौन बात कर रहे हैं हेलो पैम 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 ज्योति जी इतना टाइम क्यों लेते हैं आप हेलो बोलने के लिए क्या सस्पेंस लगा रहे हो हमारे लिए हां हां बोलो बोलो uh, आज आज का शो एंड थैंक यू सो मच आपका मैसेजेस हमें फेसबुक मिल रहा है आई थिंक चांस टू एक्चुअली रीड ऑल द मैसेजेस वाज फर्स्ट पर्सन से पैम पैम टुडे वंडरफुल तो आज वो भी कौन वेंसडे में आप कौन से गाना गाते हो जो आपको अगर दुख इफ यू फील लाइक ऑफ दैट कैन ऑफ सैडनेस What song do you sing and comes to mind? What comes to mind? Lata Ji ka composition. Lata Lata Ji ka rendition. Lata Ji ka wo wala gaana mere ko bahut achha lagta hai. Lika chitti bahut hi. Oh yeah. Bahut sad lagta hai. That's a very emotional song. Actually. Yeah, it is. It is. Oh yeah, my God. Yeah, that's a very emotional song. Yeah. And I think you know, when, I think the song also came. That's a very emotional song. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
आपने सही बताया ऐसे कुछ और याद आ गया तो कॉल कीजिएगा आपके बहुत सारे अच्छे अच्छे चॉइस आते हैं तो सुनिएगा फालतू Our mind is running in a different level, huh. so other things are coming into my presence. When talk about Luka Chupi, huh. other songs come in. Tup 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 to come in, and yeah. uh, and it's just like you know, I I want I have to slow down a little bit and say you know what, let's take a breather. Yeah. Let's see what we have, listen to what we have, enjoy a little bit of it, and come back to it. What do you think? Correct. So, Mohan Machan Sahab, I have to wait for you. I have to wait for you. So, please take a break. That song, the last film, where Dilip Kumar Sahab is on a piano. <laughs> I'm sorry Banjan I think there's Okay here you go it's coming up right now Uthaye ja unke pitam aur diye ja comment on this thing but father was still this particular movie came out 1949 yeah pretty much when she also was very new in the industry yeah even nargis was new in the industry you actually can make out if you see the video <laughs> of the dog it actually has a nargis who seems to be very kacha kacha yeah and if you listen to the song also the data of that time that of now or even for the data of the 50s 60s prior to her ex, uh, you know honing our skills right with singing you can make out the difference right. but then I mean, the song was very nice the lyrics are awesome majus tafri sahab or kya pata hai and uh, music of course is by noshadri sahab at time noshadri sahab very famous if you didn't know about that 40s 50s mein unka raaj chal raha tha wahan pe and um, yeah thoda aur sunega fazani ha of course yeah. yahi hai mohabbat ka dastoor ये गाना जो है आपको अंदाज फिल्म में से है यू सी अ वेरी यंग दिलीप कुमार साहब वदर डू यू डू यू फील दिस सॉन्ग इट साउंडेड समथिंग लाइक समबडी सम अदर सिंगर ऑफ द टाइम वाज वेरी प्रोमिनेंट अह साउंडेड लाइक दैट आई एम नॉट सेइंग दैट एक एक बिकॉज़ आई विल टेल यू इन द बिगिनिंग स्टेजेस जब लता जी को मेन फीचर गाने मिलते थे शी न्यू दैट शी हैड टू कंटेंड विद बिकॉज़ शी वाज रिजेक्टेड राइट शी See that's actually if you look at it right think about it Pranjan she was uh, a teenager mm-hmm. okay somebody who's 16 15 16 years old and right from the age of 13 she has been fighting to get a chance to sing a feature song mm. soch ke dekhega wo rejection 
बार बार बोला जाना कि तुम्हारी आवाज बहुत पतली है जब जबकि इनफैक्ट लता मंगेशकर जी की पूरी जिंदगी सिर्फ संगीत थी बिकॉज आई टेल यू वो स्कूल नहीं गई ओके एंड वो स्कूल क्यों नहीं गई दैट्स बिकॉज जब वो पहली बार स्कूल गई थी इट सीम्स she was busy singing and teaching some students around her a uh, 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 music she was like she formed this paltan and she was trying to teach them music on her very first day in school hmm. and then the teacher scolded her it seems uh, and uh, said no no you're not supposed to do all this you're supposed to focus on studying gana wana all this stuff will not happen here um, is what the teacher said so she came back home and she told her dad i'm not going to go to school anymore so wow. uh, and if i'm going to go to school i want to take uh, asha with me and go hmm. and the school refused to let her sister come along with her to she was very smart she just knew so she refused to go to school she did not go to school at all um and she was very happy she actually says in one interview ki mujhe na kl sehgal ke gaane bahut pasand the you know that's so, something very interesting yeah we always have thought of kl sehgal saab yeah and as a you know unfortunately for whatever reason yeah. all these comedians or whatever people who actually made it seem like as a kl sehgal saab ka awaaz matlab aisa hoga yeah that kind of way yeah kishor kumar saab also yeah was a huge huge fan of kl sega sahab is ashok kumar who came and told him i believe to not sing with the, not to try to sing sing with original voice yeah no wait ashok kumar actually didn't think that kishor kumar was capable of singing he would so there's this beautiful interview that i saw with nijan uh-huh. of which okay this is the way i got to share it now okay please do please so do. what happened was um uh, kishor kumar in washington dc and i stayed at this hotel i'm so happy actually uh-huh. i can see that this is the watergate hotel in uh, dc bunja it's a, it's a, that's the place where the nixon scandal happened right oh to us hotel mein hamare kishor kishor da ruke the तो लोग उनको इंटरव्यू करने आए क्योंकि उनका एक कॉन्सर्ट होने वाला था एंड लोग इंटरव्यू करने आए एंड देन ही सॉ हु द इंटरव्यूअर वॉज ही एग्री टू द इंटरव्यू दे सेड ओके इट विल बी लाइक अ कॉन्वर्जेशन बिटवीन यू एंड लता इज वॉट दे सेड सो ही एग्रीड फाइनली सेंग ओके ओके इफ लता इज गोट बी देर देन दैट्स फाइन बट देन वेन दी प्रेस रिपोर्टर केम अपेंटली ही गॉट सो टिकट ऑफ ही इज लाइक नो 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 एनी वेन ई हिड he he said i'm not going to come out i'm not going to do this i'm not going to do this interview so and uh, then he said i'm only going to come out if lata is going to do my interview oh lata ji actually she had that. to do his interview smart so it was his uh, like kabhi kabhi lagta hai kya sangeet hai right eh? but he he maybe aisa karta hai i know got any only a father ke interview nobody can interview me and and lata ji interviews hmm. him in this and it's a beautiful recording man and of course unfortunately there's um you know there's a lot of cuts in the recording but it's a it's a lovely recording where they talk about, they talk to each other they literally talking like peers right and she mm-hmm. says so what is <coughs> what did you um um you know with regard to music uh, she said music and acting mm. you are very you've been very successful as an actor and which one do you prefer mm. right and then he says obviously sangeet obviously music he says because acting is fake jhoot hai aur wo uh, jo sangeet hai wo dil se nikalta hai wah and he says um there's a big difference so acting is fake you're putting on a fake persona yeah but whatever you sing you sing from your heart mm-hmm. right otherwise it doesn't touch the audience and uh, these two were apparently really good friends altu baba uh-huh. the reason is they lo- both of them and you can see both of them agree yeah 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 you know sangeet <laughs> sangeet and then he says um you know so she says who was uh, oh music then how did you get into movies and it seems dada muni uh, he used to sing uh. <laughs> he says kishor kumar he says uh, i wanted to sing but dada muni who also got it here and he copies he yeah. like imitates the <laughs> one of the songs that dalvi and he says ho ho aise gana chahiye ho 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 and then he he like he says uh, and he looks at her and he smiles he said mujhe bola ki main theek nahi gata so it is such a cute humorous uh, episode um, that you i mean you know anybody will break into a chuckle and then he says ki you know uh, whatever happened the rest is history but he says for him he was he used to hum and he used to sing kl segal sabs um, uh, songs and that's what inspired him to uh, keep singing and that's what uh, lata ji ke 
केस में भी के एल सेगल साहब वॉज हर इंस्पिरेशन करेक्ट बट अगेन वाईरिंग ऑल दिसन बिकॉज आई थॉक्ट अबाउट द फैक्ट दट पर्टिकुलर सॉन्ग साउंड लॉट लाइक शमशार बेगम लिल बिट लिल लिल वैसे It would, it would have been extremely confused that to be a uh, Shamsar Begum song also. Yeah, and she uh, at that time, the, and why I brought the story also. Wow, we go from point to point. Is because at that time somebody who is being rejected, mm-hmm. and they come. What is he singing? Is it like that? Ah. So to Noor Jahan to imitate to do it. He was told to imitate Shamsar, imitate uh, uh, Noor Jahan. Make your voice a little thicker. Sing this way. Maybe that's part of the reason why some of these songs Could sound be, like that. Could be because, as she rightly said, right, in the previous episode, if you've not following one of the interviews, Fatu Ani followed up for Lata Ji. Uh, she had talked about the fact that unka ye tha ki they have to follow whatever the music director tells them. Yeah. That was the discipline. One of the discipline they had. So good, yeah. wonderful. So Fatu Ani, आगे बढ़ते हैं हम बुधवार को बोलते हैं कि आप भी यहाँ पे call कर सकते हो. If you have any trivia to share with us, please go ahead and do it. फिर यहाँ पे हर एक हर एक मीडिया आउटलेट अपने खुद का कुछ निकाल रहे हैं लता जी के बारे में हमारा कुछ अलग होता है कि आप वहाँ से निकालें. If you have a fact you learnt about it just recently, you didn't know about also. Give us, give us a call here. And do not make it. Do what we get here. 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 हां लोगों को मिल जाएगा नो बिग डी वी डोंट वी नो वी ओके विद दैट बट मोर द मेरियर बट द पॉइंट इज फादरनी आई थिंक वी शुड आल्सो टेल अबाउट दैट टुडे इज अबाउट वर्बी कॉल वेंसडे करेक्ट एंड दथा जी आई मीन आई डोंट नो व्हाटएवर बाय चांस और व्हाटएवर इंसिडेंटल और कोइंसिडेंटली हैज गॉट लॉट ऑफ सॉन्ग्स पैथोस रिलेटेड सॉन्ग्स जॉनरा इज नॉट देयर बट ऑफ कोर्स फीलिंग ऑफ पैथोस कम्स इन एंड यू मेजॉरिटी द सॉन्ग्स इफ यू लुक एट इट यू विल सी लता जी एज संग दो सॉन्ग्स राइट सो आज हम लोग ऐसे गानों की बात कर रहे हैं अगर आपको ऐसा गाना है जो आप गाते हो वेन यू फीलिंग लिबर लाउड एंड लो राइट सो डेफिनेटली कॉल एज एंड शेयर विद एज ऑन एयर फोर जीरो एट नाइन वन टू टू फोर सेवन नाइन चार शून्य आठ नौ एक दो दो चार सात नौ तो क्या मूड है आपका फल सोनी आ, आ, कौन सा गाना लगाने वाले हो आलतू वही तो मूड है पूछ रहा हूँ व्हाट इज द मूड टुडे आई इट इज वो भी गॉन मूड आलतू हाँ 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 मतलब नो होप एट ऑल तो वही नो होप उमंगी नहीं है ओ माय गॉड दैट्स ट्रू क्या गाना है बॉस द सैड सैडेस्ट सॉन्ग ऑफ ऑल टाइम्स ना कोई उमंग है Uh-huh. ना कोई तरंगे इमेजिन इफ समबडी वुड गिव अप होप लाइक दैट माय गुडनेस मेरी जिंदगी है क्या एक कटी पतंग है लॉर्ड इट्स रियली रियली सैड ओ माय गॉड एंड ऑफ कोर्स दिस इज लता मंगेशकर वाज गोना मेक यू क्राई फॉर शेवर जन यस हियर यू गो एंजॉय द सॉन्ग and of course it's a beautiful song as you said actually is a total i think this is like a hopeless situation when you feel like hopeless situation right and hmm bol 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 ye uh, in fact uh, agar aap lata ji ki zindagi se dekhenge right compare karenge mm-hmm. unki zindagi ke bahut acche ka ek isse kahaniyan humne sunaye hain aapko mm-hmm. ki unki jo activities uh, matlab like you know she used to be an ardent cricket fan yeah um she used to uh, do photography mm-hmm. um she used to have this huge collection of cars she mm-hmm. liked collecting cars mm-hmm. um and uh, another thing that was very interesting about her mm-hmm. uh, was jo shayad hum log kal share karne wale the but in any case i'll share with you ki she is a huge teri jaisi aalto ba mahima ji ji jaisi thi बहुत तीखा तीखा खाती थी शी इज टू ईट स्पेशली द लाल महाराष्ट्र ने भाई महाराष्ट्र जय महाराष्ट्र या एंड दे जनरली से कि लाल मिर्च खाने से योर थ्रोट इज इट्स ग्रो गुड फॉर योर थ्रोट शी इज लाइक शी मैं शी नेवर यूज्ड टू बॉदर अबाउट दैट शी वुड बिकॉज़ शी नीड्स दैट दैट स्पाइस एंड दैट हीट इन हर फूड एंड आई नो इट्स नाइस इट्स राइट बट अगेन द सॉन्ग व्हिच यू जस्ट ऑन पिक्ड आई एम गोइंग टू से समथिंग आई आई वाज गोइंग टू टेल यू कि ये उन उन्होंने एक आ, कभी किसी ने पूछा उनसे कि हैव यू एवर फेल्ट दैट लोनलीनेस और एनीथिंग एंड शी एक्चुअली सेड दैट 
I don't know if I can call it loneliness, but I feel an emptiness. Aww. And she said it's become more because I lost my really, really good friends. When Nargis passed away, when Meena Kumari passed away, people whom I could talk to, people whom I could connect with. And, um, you know, uh, Gita Dutt passed away. Uh, she says, I lost all these people along the way. You know, mm. not only losing somebody who's your lover, but also friends, uh, your tribe, people mm. whom you uh, whom you want to be with, whom you can talk to mm. and bounce things off with. And she says another person that she was uh, really, and of course, Kishore Da. Mm -hmm. And then another person she was really, really good friends with was Devanand Saab. And mm. she says, uh, sh this interview was right after Devanand Saab passed away, like about a year or so. And she said she used to. They used to talk regularly, it seems. Mm. And she says when Dev Sa passed away, it's uh, after that. She said there's really nobody that would every time pick up the phone and talk to me. Mm. And there wasn't a really uh, the po uh, phone um, that uh, I mean the part where uh, she she felt mm. uh, the people that she, uh, who sort of were in uh, touch with her. She says amongst the stars were Sonu Nigam, mm -hmm. a sing singer, Mese, and she says Shankar Mahadevan, Hari Haran, mm -hmm. and of course Anu Malik. Ah, Anu Malik. Now the second one's always that way, compassion. The, uh, uh, and of course Shahrukh Khan. There you go. So I told you. Yeah, these are the people who kind of like would check in on her regularly from time to time. Mm. She says, uh, you know, she had a good relationship with everybody. Mm. And of course, uh, you know. Hey, Malini, you didn't talk to her Malini. She didn't talk about that. Oh, wow. She said, these are the people. And she says, uh, oh, oh, but oh, she says, no regrets. She says, I don't want even, or don't even want to repent. But whatever it is, whatever I'm feeling, it uh, when I sing, it brings me the utmost joy. And mm. that's why we're saying, we'll be gone mm. with Laraji's song. So this beautiful song, Manujan, which is from the movie Kadi Patang, right? Kadi Patang, music by R.D. Barman Saab, lyrics by Anand Bakshi. <laughs> Kati Patang, people who don't understand Hindi, don't know what Patang is. Patang is nothing but a, a kite, which actually, and of course, Kati Patang is like when, when the, the door is broken, the thread is broken, it just floats around all by itself. Yeah, exactly. What a, what a simile, a metaphor, what do you call it, right? Poetry is wonderful. Anand Bakshi Saab's uh, lyric, lyrics tha, and Ardi Berman's uh, music composition. And of course, we actually talked about how what a wonderful team play she was. The bunch of songs she has done with a bunch of uh, music directors. And Ardi Berman Saab was one of them, actually. That's wonderful. So, Fadani, how is the future of the future? The future of the future is the future of the future. What is the future of the future? What is the future of the future? What is the future of the future? Kind of thing, right? Mm -hmm. Actually, when we were sharing about their stories, I thought it was like this one story that we shared with her, which was really, which uh, we talked about, mm -hmm. where we thought, oh, she was so innocent, she didn't even know that, you know, she had to go and uh, eat in the cafeteria, in yeah. the studio. Yeah. When she's sitting in the studio and, uh, you know, recording the thing, I could go and eat. Months, it went on like this. Actually, think about it, Altu, ki how secluded one must be feeling, right? Hmm. At that age, that everybody else used to go and, you know, um, all the men, and it was a male-dominated industry, right? Because chorus singers are mostly male, hote te, right? Mm -hmm. So, um, and then, uh, how... Uh, I mean, if you just think back to that era, put yourself in her situation. I f uh, there's a tinge of sadness you feel, right? That mm. uh, she would um, she would go hungry, mm. and uh, she would not be in a position to uh, to eat. In fact, there was one time when she supposedly passed out at the studio, mm. 
and that is how this whole thing came out about her going hungry because people thought she was a uh, famished and she couldn't eat she mm-hmm. didn't have money so sh- um, the main thing was she would also even if she what she would do is she said uh, that the money that she got she would actually take the train or bus or whatever wherever and she go back and she would buy bhaji kharid ke she would go home so that she can make food for her Aww. siblings mm-hmm. so um and uh, she says it very casually but you actually think about it as a teenager the kind of pressure that was on her mm. and the fact that uh, how secluded and segregated as a woman she must have been feeling kyunki abhi bhi india mein aisa hai ki ek, ek lady generally akele baithke nahi kha, kha sakti you know in a restaurant or mm. whatever and people don't include you they don't say come with us and eat mm. Mm. you know it's um and she was saying yeah, i mean it's kind of sad for me i felt that was like even i was nowadays, thinking about it even, even nowadays i don't think even these days you would find a lady sit by herself and eat at a restaurant really yeah you yeah. would see them in a bar and they'll never let them alone <laughs> the guys <laughs> are going to chasing after them anyways the problem is okay that's that's true i agree with you on this that's what actually builds character i suppose in her and tells you a lot and tells you no that we should not take our freedom for granted yeah what we have right now never take it for granted because wo zamana socho was pre independence ke time pe how difficult it would be for a lady to first of all step out and go find fend for themselves right? right it's so hard when she actually was the sole bread earner for the family until of course as had she also got in and her brothers also started getting into a music production and they had their own troops coming up right right so tab tak to unko sambhalna padta na so hats off to that for sure yeah and and i think no alta baba i kind of draw a parallel mm. like uh, sirf ye nahi tha ki wo unko malum nahi tha ki canteen kahan hai right mm-hmm. but uh, in one of those uh, conversations um, she talks about actually lata ji had a struggle with food and appetite mm. she says as she grew older even when she had the money mm. um she would not eat because she was constantly like um going from session to session to session that she would say that jab tak khana uh, thanda pad jata tha and then i wouldn't feel like eating and i would just not have an appetite to eat mm. it's almost like um because her her goal was i have to make ends meet i have to do this and i have to keep doing what i'm doing it it gives you the uh, the plight of a a breadwinner especially women who are breadwinners in india right it reminded me of a single mom who who went through similar situations and it kind of um drives home a very um s- uh, this image of this person who is so caught up in what she has to do and mujhe ye karna hai ye mera kartavya hai mera ye hai ki she neglected herself that mm-hmm. self care self love jo bolte hain mm-hmm. um she did and apparently her food problem persisted for decades decades and decades um and uh, they say that she but she doesn't blame her family in any which way mm-hmm. she says she did all that happily and there's no regrets in life wonderful so we have one more the waiting line can we go to them please yeah namaskar aapka hardik swagat hai fam fam ki wo bhi kaun mera name is this namaskar jai shri krishna naren ji kaise sab kaise hai sir bahut badhiya aap kaise ho first class naren ji to aaj to wo bhi kaun mera name is waise to aap to pathos king ke bade fan ho mukesh ji ke fan ho lekin aap bataiye kya aapke zehen mein kabhi kabhi ek man's perspective for a change so man calling us right now आप जब आप थोड़ा डाउन होते हो लो होते हो ऐसा कोई गाना आता है जिसमें लता जी का गाना है जो आप सोचते हैं उसके बारे में लता जी का गाना लॉट ऑफ सॉन्ग नहीं नहीं बट लेकिन जब आप सैड होते हो आई एम श्योर यूल थिंक ऑफ समैड सॉन्ग विच इज एंड बाई मुकेश जी आई अंडरस्टैंड बट हज इट एवर हैपन यूर थॉट ऑफ अ सॉन्ग आप कभी इस मूड में हो थोड़ा सैड मूड में हो आप और आपके जहन में कोई ऐसा गाना आ गया लता जी का तो अरे वाह हाँ ये गाना आप अपने दिन में यू नो अपने मन में गुनगुना रहे हो या निजी लाइफ में ऐसे गुनगुना दिया तो कैसा कुछ है किस्सा है आपके यहाँ पे जो आप वंडरफुल सर लेकिन आप मुझे एक समझाइएगा ये गाना जो है वॉज रिटन बाई दिस नेम 
बट इस गाने के जो बोल है हमने इस गाने के बारे में दो तीन दिन दो कल परसों संडे को एक्चुअली डिस्कस किया था कल 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 सकते थे नहीं नहीं दो दिन पहले तो गुलजार जी ना तो शिखवा तो नहीं बाद में आता है सेकेंड लाइन में तेरे बिना जिंदगी 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 तो आप तो इसमें ना एक एक है कि तेरे बिना जिंदगी से मतलब प्रॉब्लम इन लाइफ तेरे बिना जिंदगी से कोई शिकवा नहीं और मतलब आप बोल रहे भगवान प्रॉब्लम है तो इसका मतलब समझाइए I want to see God, and because I cannot see Him, I'm complaining that darshan do, darshan do mujhe. नहीं नहीं लेकिन ये गाना जो है specifically अगर आप सोचे जाएँ तो तेरे बिना ज़िंदगी से कोई शिखवा तो नहीं. शिखवा का मतलब होता है उर्दू में problem. Complaint. Complaint. हाँ. Right. So you're saying that the biggest complaint is you. हाँ. In my life. And without you, there's no problem at all in my life. Yeah. Is that what they're saying? Is the question. क्या कह रहे हैं क्या? What do you think is happening in the song? सोचो। वन, इट्स सेइंग दैट तेरे बिना जिंदगी से सिखवा नहीं है। तो आई आई डोंट हैव कंप्लेन। अदर देन यू। तू नहीं है तोड़ नहीं। मतलब नहीं नहीं तेरे बिना जिंदगी से कोई सिखवा नहीं। तेरे बिना मतलब विदाउट यू आई डोंट हैव एनी प्रॉब्लम। समझ रहे हैं आप ना ये गुलजार साहब का यू कंफ्यूज मी कंफ्यूज नहीं गुलजार साहब का ये मैं कंफ्यूज में आपको क्लाइंट दे रहा हूँ आई थिंक आई थिंक इट इस डन ऑन पर्पस इट इस डन ऑन पर्पस गुलजार सी इस ब्यूटीफुल वे ऑफ राइटिंग पोइट्री या एंड सेकंड लाइन इस आई गिव यू हिंट इन दैट विदाउट यू जिंदगी जिंदग but mm-hmm. आप अगर मीनिंग दे हुए ना यू अंडरस्टैंड व्हाट अ ब्यूटीफुल एंडिशन ऑफ सेइंग दैट आई कांट लिव विथ आई कांट लिव विदाउट यू मतलब तेरे बिना जिंदगी से कोई विदाउट यू आई हैव नो प्रॉब्लम इन लाइफ बट विदाउट यू देयर इज नो लाइफ हां समझ रहा हूं ना तो मतलब इट्स इट्स अ वेरी इट्स अ वेरी अ स्टेटमेंट व्हिच एक्चुअली गोस इन बोथ वेज एंड इट्स अ ब्यूटीफुल पोएट्री बाय गुलजार साहब हैट्स ऑफ टू हिम अगर वो ही लिखे हैं तो डेफिनेटली हैट्स ऑफ टू हिम एंड ऑफ कोर्स एवरीबॉडी स्टार्ट लविंग द सॉन्ग बिकॉज़ लता जी सांग द सॉन्ग एंड द मेलोडी ऑफ द सॉन्ग इज ग्रेट करेक्ट वेरी ट्रू वेरी ट्रू यस सर मैं आप एडमिट कंफ्यूज हूँ सर लेकिन आपको अभी क्लारिटी मिला ना क्या ये वेक्स्ट आउट वाला सॉन्ग है क्या ये कंप्लेंट वाला सॉन्ग है क्या ये लव सॉन्ग है क्या ये लव सॉन्ग है काफी सारे हैं मतलब यू विल नेवर बी एबल टू पुट इनटू वन पर्टिकुलर ब्रैकेट और वन पर्टिकुलर साइलो हाँ इट्स अ ब्यूटीफुल सॉन्ग एंड जब 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 वो जब वो कहता है कि तुम जो कह दो तो आज की रात चांद डूबेगा नहीं इजी स वो इतने सारे I mean the lyrics of the song are just incredible and पंजाम दाने क्या धुन सजाया इस गाने का मस्त है beautiful and situation भी बहुत खूबसूरत है but thank you so much नरेंद्र जी नरेंद्र जी आपको हम मिलेंगे for sure लेकिन yeah सुनते रहेगा we have some wonderful songs for you ठीक है thank you so much thank you very much thank you sir and of course मुझे ना job was not to confuse you guys but देखो कितना beautifully it was that yeah it wasn't that actually hey I had a question that particular song is shown to be um picture is a picture of a lady the guy uh it's both of them it's a duet song is it <coughs> interesting yeah they meet after i think um several years it's supposed to be loosely based on uh, indira gandhi's life right so ah, suchita yes, sen yes. and sanji and what um, my god kya performance yaar seriously hey, it's okay. like uh, so again let's come back to what we talked about right it's not only performance the mise en scene yes it's everything not only the poetry gulzar saab hats off to you kishor and lata किशोर जी रहता हाँ हाँ देखो द डायनामिक्स इट्स एन इनक्रेडिबल वी शुड प्ले दैट यार वो केमिस्ट्री होता है यार बिकॉज़ यू नो व्हाई आई 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 वेरी स्ट्रॉंग फीलिंग्स इन दैट यू नो आज के ज़माने व्हाई डू व्हाई आई डोंट लाइक ड्यूट सॉंग्स यू आई वी स्पोकन अबाउट सम टाइम राइट बट मेरे को ये आज के ज़माने में गानी आई डोंट डजन 
बिकॉज केमिस्ट्री वॉज नॉट दैट इज नॉट दैट अरे इज नॉट दैट उन जमाने में केमिस्ट्री होनी चाहिए थी बिकॉज दे सैंग द सॉन्ग इन ईच अदर्स प्रेसेंस सो दे वर्ड बाउंस ऑन ईच अदर्स एनर्जीज राइट आजकल क्या है शेयर गोश रिकॉर्ड ऑन स्टूडियो अरजीत सिंह रिकॉर्ड ऑन स्टूडियो सेंड द एम पी थ्री फाइल और वॉट वन ऑडियो वेव फाइल टू दम सो वन ऑफ जनरेशन लॉस एंड विशाल तारे सिट्स इन स्टूडियो एंड मिक्स अप That's all they'll do. Sorry about the Vishaji. I I always call you out on these things. I don't. Yeah, technology use karo, but also bring the human element to it. Because the moment you use technology, you're extracting, ex, you're removing out the human element totally from people's things. So how will we have a generation which understands what empathy is? Right. <sighs> Namaskar, Abkar. It's for the Pam Pam. Okay, who be gone Wednesday? Me, who's this? Hello. Pam Pam. Oh, oh. Oh, such a topic like here today. So. Thank you so much for having me. Sir, Abkar. Yo, how many like how many songs like uh, like leaves are there? Like sad song. Tell me, which to keep me? Yeah, you know. Yes. On both, everyone was so good. Yes. Yes. Very nice topic. Thank, Thank you, you so much. much. And up now. यकीन नहीं मानोगे ये जो नेक्स्ट गाना हम लोगों ने लाइन लाइन अप किया था एंड आई एम सो ग्लैड दैट यू यू एक्चुअली रोड अबाउट दैट आई थिंक यू रोड अबाउट दैट फाल्गुनी जी ऑन फेसबुक ये महिमा yeah. जी का फेवरेट गाना था लता मंगेशकर जी का मेघा छाई आधी रात सबके आंगन दिया जले मेरे आंगन जी वेरी नाइस सॉन्ग राखी और राखी इसमें बहुत अच्छी लग रही है पर एक्सीडेंटली मेघा से एक्सीडेंटली मेघा जी हो गया है मगर आई मीन उसे मेघा छाया या 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 हाँ बताइए तो आपका कोई आपको कुछ शेयर करना है हाँ मैं सोच रही थी जैसे तो सर सॉन्ग बहुत ही है मगर वेन वेन यू फील डाउन जनरली आई विल सींग तुझसे नाराज नहीं जिंदगी हैरान हूँ मैं हाँ, तेरे हाँ. मासूम सवालों से परेशान हूँ अरे तो आपका इतना अच्छा आवाज है थोड़ा गा दो यार हमारी आप इतना अच्छे अच्छे लता जी के सॉन्ग है कहाँ हम गाएंगे तो अच्छा नहीं मैं तो ऐसे ही बोल रही थी आप दिल से गाइए ना सॉन्ग वेरी मच हाँ तो दिल दिल से गा दो एक दो लाइन गुंगना दो हमारे लिए ओके ओके तुझसे नाराज नहीं जिंदगी हैरान हूँ मैं हो हैरान हूँ मैं तेरे मासूम सवालों पे परेशान थैंक Yeah. And of course, आप भी यहाँ पे कॉल कर सकते हैं लेखा और फागुन जी और नरेन जी एवरीबॉडी इज कॉलिंग आज इंक्लूडिंग यू नो ज्योति जी यू कॉल्ड अस अ फ्यू मिनट्स अगो शेयरिंग देयर सॉन्ग्स विद द लाइक एंड ऑफ कोर्स अगर वो सॉन्ग हमारे लिस्ट पे आ गए तो यार बम्पर है हां लगा ही देंगे जैसे कि अभी जो हमारे जिक्र की उन्होंने गाने की um, जो um, uh, फालतूनी बताया था इट्स वन ऑफ महिमा जी फेवरेट सॉन्ग आल्सो राइट या या तो उसको थोड़ा सुन के आए थे हम लोग बिकॉज़ इट्स अ ब्यूटीफुल सॉन्ग वन जन एंड सेल्डम मेड बहुत ही खूबसूरत गाना है सुनिएगा एंजॉय कीजिएगा योर लिसनिंग टू दिस ऑन रेडियो डी हॉटीज मीडिया महिमा प्रेजेंटेशन एज अ डेडिकेशन एंड अ श्रद्धांजलि टू ऑफ कोर्स टू लता मंगेशकर जी एंड ऑफ कोर्स वन जन हमने 2 मिनट पहले आरडी बम साहब की बात की तो उनकी बात क्या उनके बाप के बारे में बात करेंगे अभी तो बिकॉज़ उनके एस डी बर्मन साहब का ये कॉम्पोजिशन है
Kumar Banjan, a beautiful song. Ye film malum hai kya kya which movie it is from? Ah, I put you on the spot. <laughs> and who is the music director? I will be the director S D Burman. I told you already about and it. And who is the lyricist? Lyricist ke baare mein maine poocha hi nahi tere se. Ah, maine tere se poochi hu kya maine poocha hi nahi. To maine poochi. Mujhe bas ye gana bahut yaad jaye. Go to the next. Ha, beautiful, beautiful lyrics hai, beautiful alfaz hai. in yeah. in in fact our very own um, uh, we've done i think uh, aradhana sharma ji did a show mm-hmm. on mahima uh, mahima zarmol nagme uh, with uh, this i think the song has did you guys feature yeah, the song yeah, yeah. and uh, i- in fact unke ye is movie ke sare gaane kitne khoobsurat gaane yeah, hain yes. uh, khilte hain gul yahan khilke bikharne kaun sa film hai lekin pata nahi sharmili sharmili yes 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 it's uh, every single song in this movie was a super hit and har gaane ke jo bol hai dil ko chhu jane wale bol hai beautiful yeah. songs in the movie and this uh, particular song megha chahi aadhi raat uh, is a uh, is again another very uh, sad song again kind of um resonating the loneliness and the solitude you know i we look in retrospect right yeah was there a connection between her style of rendition yeah was there a connection between that style of rendition and her real life is a question coming up right now after post famous of well, after she's passed on right yeah we think of those things right now yeah but i don't know i wouldn't like to i wouldn't like to say that because i would think that that's not fair that there was a connection no but i'm just saying that you could know could be could be there i don't uh, in yeah. life in life hum log um, jaise channel karte hain right uh-huh, ek uh-huh. artist kya karta hai i mean agar rona hai to uh, <laughs> you actually channel you, you have to get into character and you bring out all that pain that is within you right mm-hmm. and uh, that you have experienced it's all something if you've never experienced something is very hard to actually uh, जिसमें until he has a heartbreak they don't show him as a good singer at all right yeah yeah, yeah. i don't think it's all bull pucky but no i i think that what they talk about is when um, we are uh, you know you reach into the depths of your soul only when you go through some challenges in life probably and yes every, depths of your soul yeah yeah exactly and lo ke thank you you have to experience no you don't ha- necessarily have to experience the exact same thing that somebody else has experienced for you to be able to um uh, bring uh, to to empathize lekin hamare khud ke jo experiences hain wo hame sikhate hain ki that we need to look inside because at the end of the day when we survive it's only through ha bol only through what finish your sentence father only through um through your lived experiences and how you're able to get over it ah. that builds on your strength of character is what Very i was saying good. i know father i, I got a connection as to why they say heartbreak hone chahiye ha when you talked about depth of your soul yeah depth matlab 
गहराइया गहराइया एंड वेन यू फील डिप्रेस यू गो इन टू द आप डूबते जाते हो आप डूबते डूबते गहराइयों तक पहुंच जाते हो दैट इज एबल टू फील डेप्थ ऑफ योर सोल बाई गॉड रेवलेशन That's doing, not doing, doing. It's like tan, 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 tan. This is a conversation about money. So basically, you can actually get to the particular point without feeling <laughs> so, without feeling sad. Is what I'm trying to say. Ha. You can just you know feel the empathy of somebody deep down, depth Correct. of your soul, like Father Ani talked about. Yeah. Father Ani, how about we just play a song of S D Raman Sab with Nirat Sab lyrics, Lata yeah. Ji's voice. Yeah. How about we play a song S D Raman, Lata Ji, and Sahil Dharmi's lyrics. Of course. Let's okay? go. ये गाना मैं बताया था कि हमारे लिस्ट में था ऑलरेडी मतलब मच प्लेड बट अ वेरी ब्यूटीफुल सॉन्ग एंड मेघा जी थैंक यू फॉर एक्चुअली गिविंग अस द रिक्वेस्ट सो वी कैन बंप इट अप अ लिटिल बिट एंड आई होप यू लाइक द सॉन्ग एंड फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल लेट मी जस्ट गो रिकॉग्नाइज द बंदूज एक्चुअली आर जॉइनिंग अस ऑन फेसबुक थैंक यू सो मच मेघा जी फॉर जॉइनिंग अस ऑन फेसबुक ओवर देयर एज़ वेल एंड वी हैव ज्योति जी एक्चुअली पोस्टिंग ओवर देयर दीपा जी नमस्ते थैंक यू सो मच फॉर कॉलिंग एंड कॉल बैक अगेन ऑल्सो दीपा जी अगर आप कोई ऐसा शेयर करना हो तो कॉल करके शेयर कीजिएगा समटाइम्स वी वाइल ऑन द शो इट माइट बी डिफिकल्ट फर्स्ट टू एक्चुअली गो थ्रू ऑल योर कम वी डू we do go through all your comments and things like that so do post and keep it active there and uh, we want to say, give a shout out to uh, uh, jaspreet ji joining us there uh, shout out to vishal ji who actually joined us there vishal ji call nahi kiya lekin uh, call mm-hmm. ki jagah yahan pe you can actually share your thoughts also your you can actually it's it's more like a think of it like a tribute show but a different kind of tribute show and uh, um, deepa ji hum aapke gaane uh, dekhe lekin um, aaj jo humne line up kiye hain kafi sare gaane wo देखिए अब गूगल सर्च मारोगे तो सभी इस गूगल सर्च ऑफ सैड सॉन्ग्स ऑफ लता मंगेशकर दो सॉन्ग्स विल कम अप ऑन टॉप रहना बीती जाए बीती ना बिताए yeah. रहना we don't want to play the songs that are anyway going to get played all Lekin, the time right hum log na we have been spoiled by a wonderful show called mon lagme yeah <laughs> yeah but mamma ji taught us to look, look for those wonderful gems and that's what time to pay for yeah. pay show five for you here yeah we're no denying that those are beautiful songs mm-hmm. and aaj bas hum log un gaanon ko uh, air time de rahe hain jahan pe uh, kuch shayad na mile ho aapne kab suna tha megha chhai aadhi raat ko correct when yeah. did you listen to that when so did you listen to that nigah hai even the song tum na jaane किस जगह जहां में खो गए करेक्ट 
and when did you listen to the uh, the song from mughal e azam where she is getting uh, yeah. killed right where when was the last that you listened to that song mm-hmm. khuda nigah nigeban ho um you know these are all songs that are beautifully rendered and and really heart touching mm. but really didn't get the time of day so to speak or don't get the time of day even today yeah. so isiliye wo gaane hum log baja rahe hain to let's go to bandhu namaskar aapka hardik swagat hai pam pam mein kaun hai ji mohammad merchant assalam alaikum bhai aapne itna pyara gaana sunaya mimmi aur devanan aur film ka naam tha saza correct उट सजा खुदा की कसम बड़ी प्यारी गायिका सही है सर सही और कभी उसने अपनी फीस ही बढ़ाई वो हमेशा पाँच हजार रूपए पर गाना लेती थी हाँ मतलब तीन सौ रूपए स्टार्ट किया उन्होंने एंड कहा वो सब छोड़ दीजिए हाँ वी डोट टॉक अबाउट डेमोट्रेशन वी कैन टॉक अबाउट द फैक्ट दैट शी वाज वेरी फ्रेंडली विद पीपल शी शी वाज शी ट्रीट ऑल हर फैमिली शी ट्रीट द होल फ्रेटर्निटी एज अ फैमिली ऑफ हर्स एक्चुअली सो वाज वंडरफुल ऑफ हर सही है सर थैंक यू सो मच सर और कुछ गाना याद आ रहा है आपको उनका जो सैड सॉन्ग है मेरे को अभी एक गाना याद आ रहा है हां मेरे साले मेरे जहन से निकल गया था कल भी मैं भी मान गया था हां और मैं हफ्ते पे इसी गाने को गा रहा था दो तीन दफा गाया मैंने आपको बताता हूँ फोन हाँ आराम से सोच के कॉल कीजिएगा थैंक यू सो मच फॉर इन बिटवीन ऑफ कोर्स अभी मैं आपको एक सुपर डुपर गाना लगाने वाला हूँ विच एक्चुअली इज अ कॉम्बिनेशन ड्यूएथ सॉन्ग ऑफ लता जी एंड तलत में मुझा अच्छा Yeah, did you know about that? Which one, Alto Baba? This is a. Hey, you should know the song, right? I I. Oh no, this is not the song. This is a, the song which I'm going to play is not that one. And wo alag ba. Show me play ho gaya last week. So, I want to make a song. Tell me. Yes, tell me. Sorry, my dear. Song, Faltu ka. Yes. Do you know that Lata Ji has experienced everything? Yes. 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 um at a very young age mm-hmm. uh has experienced the incredible um burden that comes with being the sole breadwinner to uh, support all your siblings mm. in your family at a very tender age um definitely discrimination unhone experience kiya hoga mm-hmm. definitely unko um aside from all that she was also poisoned at yeah. one time In 1962, really? she was yes. Wow. Uh, somebody had given her uh, apparently uh, it was a very close shave with death mm. where she was hospitalized and apparently mm-hmm. it was somebody had poisoned her. Jealousy. Um, and they say that um, it it took almost she was in the hospital for over ten days mm. and was bedridden for three months, and they say even till. till now even after she has passed on mm. they haven't been able to st- uh, solve the issue mm. but they claim that it could be the cook because the cook suddenly disappeared without even taking his pagar when 90s was it 1962 9962 mein wow that's quite a long time back. yeah wow yeah so she's experienced even that mm. so that was a peak time of her career right yeah yeah but we have a bandu waiting line let's see if they can actually unravel the mystery namaskar kaat swadeep fam fam ki wo be gone wednesday me who's this hello 
मोहम्मद यस मर्चेंट साहब याद आ गया हाँ हाँ याद आ गया तुम भी भूला दो मैं भी भूला नहीं यार ये तो नूर जहान का है हाँ जी सर हाँ आप तो दूर जहां के बड़े फैन हो जमाने में अच्छा एक काम करते आप सोच के वापस कॉल कीजिएगा आई डेफिनेटली मेक श्योर आई कैन लर्न इट फॉर यू ताकि समझ कॉलेज में सर तो फाजवाणी हाँ I have let's play the song. Let's come further. 80s में आते हैं क्योंकि काफी सारे गाने बज गए हैं वहाँ पे 60s, 70s के. Are we going to close out with this song, Althabha? We probably will close out this song. But thank you so much, Banerjee, for being with us today. Wait, wait. I, there's a significance behind this song. Oh, please, please tell. Um, she was interviewed by Javed Akhtar Saab, and in this interview, Banerjee, uh, this was for a private network. And जब Javed Akhtar Saab ने उनसे पूछा कि कोई ऐसा गाना है जो आपके दिल के बहुत करीब है. Think about it. She said it's really hard to pick. <clears throat> and he said something that resonates with you and your life. You know what song she picked? The song. She said, "Ay dil e nada." And the reason she says that this was a this is a song written by uh, who is it? Janasar Akhtar, is it? Akhtar Saab, yes. Uh, it's Javed Akhtar Saab's father who wrote this song, and she actually this song is about solitude and loneliness, and. The uh, in this she's a queen, right? Azia Sultana. Yeah, yeah. She's a queen. Mm-hmm. I mean, it it kind of uh, it 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 resonates with uh, Lata Mangeshkar, the queen of melody, mm-hmm. and yet had uh, you know her whole life resounded with loneliness and yeah. solitude. Yeah, yeah. They say people, uh, the royal family, don't don't think they have everything in the world. They don't have. Yeah. They might have, but they can't enjoy all everything in the world. Yeah. <laughs> It's a very solid, solitude life up there. So. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And she said she herself picked the song, and she said that this song kind of resonates with her the most. Mm. So. Um, anyway, so. Oh, we well, uh, again, that also songs actually helped her in her life, I suppose, because when you are exposed to wonderful poems like this. Yeah. You actually have a different you, your perspective on life changes. Yeah. So इसी के साथ बंजा हम लोग भी change करने वाले हैं. We're gonna be moving into our closure of right now. Uh, have a wonderful Wednesday. Will be gone Wednesday along with the last song is what we actually heard right now. Any going away thoughts, Fatoni? We'll come back. This song with Jan. The reason um, when uh, Javed Akhtar Saab asked her that "Koi aisa gana jo aapke zehn mein reh gaya ho, to jiske baare mein aapne bahut socha ho," so she thought for some time, and then she said, "Ay dil e nadan." For people who uh, who may not really understand, this is actually a very soulful song. Jahan pe she is talking about she is mulling over her desires, her purpose in life. And her loneliness. Yeah, because the lyrics itself says that, right? Arzu kya hai? Arzu is uh, what you want. Yeah. Just to, just to choose your quest. Yeah. What is your quest? What's the that's the biggest question? Most. That's why I said the poets who are there are both easily written. Exactly. Shyamlo written. Yeah. And it has a world of meaning in it. Yeah. Exactly. So uh, to the Razia Sultana, Azia 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 Sultana, And um, we are glad that Lata Ji has left this world of woes, and has um, transcended all of us with her beautiful music that will live on um, over here for generations and generations. Yeah, and of course, Unka just to just to do what will happen? Probably she left us with wonderful songs mm-hmm. to pick us up when we feel down. Absolutely. And thank you for that, and may her soul rest in peace. Yes. 
गुड नाइट शब्बा खैर कल मिलेंगे ऑन गुड मॉर्निंग डे एट नाइन ए एम प्यार भरा की दिलारी फालतू रानी आई होप यूर एंजॉइंग एवरी वन ऑफ दॉन्ग्स वी हैव लाइन अप फॉर यू बंधु जानी दिस इज रेडियो दी हॉरीज वे एंटरटेनमेंट एंगेजमेंट एक्साइटमेंट एवरीथिंग कीप्स गेटिंग हॉटर